Uh, again, Ronnie's sex tips are in. They're all disgusting. I mean, I'm at home on my computer. I was fucking grossed out. I know, me too. I don't even like the the first three were okay. Like they weren't so bad. These were really gross. So I was on the fence. No, I think the reason why is because I, you know, if Ronnie was making this shit up to get on the air, I'd yeah. say this, but he's not. No, this is respect. him. This um, <laughs> this is a real look into Ronnie. These sex tips are so vile. Yeah, it makes you want to never have sex again. <laughs> yeah, right. <laughs> and now, a sexy tip from Ronnie the Limo Driver. When your girl or your guy is giving you a blowjob, just grab his hair into the scalp and start massaging the head. The guy's head, it'll be the best blowjob you ever got. And when you come, she'll just drink it all, man. Just drink it all. Ugh, he is fucking vile. What did he just say? It doesn't make sense what he just said. He said, if you're getting... I think he, he's saying if you blow a guy, <laughs> grab... I, right! I thought yeah. he was talking about a guy's head being rubbed. What's he talking about? <laughs> but wait a second. And now, a sexy tip from Ronnie the Limo Driver. When your girl or your guy is giving you a blowjob... When just your gra- girl or, or your, your guy... your guy is giving you a blowjob. All right, job. so if you're homosexual, right? Grab his hair into the scalp. So he's talking more like a gay man. Yeah. <laughs> but so, so he's saying. I'm assuming Ronnie's heterosexual, but when his girl is giving him a blowjob, he rubs her head. He massages her head. Oh. <laughs> oh God. What must that look like? <laughs> And start massaging the head, the guy's head. It'll be the best blow. The guy's head. It's just the weird. The guy's wow. head. Yeah. I don't know what, where he got this. Maybe he means the girl should be. But how would she reach his head if she's blowing him? Uh, no, this is, this is. That's why I had to stop. I said, yeah. "What is he saying?" You think Ronnie's a switch hitter? Because this tape sure sounds. Your girl like... or your guy? And well, then... remember, he said, "I like to meet girls. I like to meet guys." Mm, yeah. <laughs> and then he goes, yeah, and then you're rubbing his head, grab his hair. Yeah. Job you ever got. And when you come, she'll just drink it all, man. Just drink it all. Oh. Uh, wow. Yeah. <laughs> Throw up. <laughs> it makes you want to never have sex again. <laughs> yeah, right? <laughs> I got a bunch of them. You want to hear another one? Yeah. Well, what else can we learn? <laughs> and now, a sexy tip. From Ronnie the Limo Driver. Hey, here's a sexy tip. <laughs> if you got a guy, if you got a chick, you grab his head, you stuff it in his ass. <laughs> Wait, did I say that? <laughs> <laughs> a lot of girls don't like to get fingers, so what you do is you spread them open wide on the bed, as wide as possible. Even if you could tie their legs down to the bed somehow, so they can't close them back up. It's <laughs> oh, like rape. Lay him down. down. <laughs> like a boat. <laughs> like a lean to. Hey, she's a yurt. You take your middle finger and you start to tickle their clit very lightly, very, very lightly, and watch them squirm. I'm telling you, man, if you never saw a girl squirm before, you might see it happen then. This has been a sex wow. tip yeah. from Ron. Do you want to I throw can't up? Take it. Wear your raincoat. <laughs> he's gonna lash you down to the bed and maybe tie you up. Yeah. yeah. And then he's gonna what? He's gonna finger you. I'm he's going to tickle you until you squirt. It was a squirt. particular finger, wasn't it? Like the middle the thumb. finger. He's going to take his thumb. thumb. <laughs> <laughs> Tickle your clit. <laughs> your clit. Oh. <laughs> I keep your fingers out of everybody. <laughs> Girls don't like to be fingered. So tie them up. <laughs> so they can't escape. <laughs> Duck tape their mouths closed. They don't know what's good for them. Oh. Should we check Ronnie's apartment? Does he have three girls in there locked up? <laughs> Speaking of apartments, I got a bunch more of these tips. Do you want to keep going with this? <laughs> you want to hear one more? One yeah. more. All right. And now, a sexy tip from Ronnie the Limo Driver. If you want to really turn your girlfriend on, start biting on her neck. Little bites, little bites, like little Dracula bites. And then, while you're fucking her, you get on top of her. You get right in her ear, and you start breathing real heavy. And every once in a while, you touch her ear with your tongue, and you listen to her moan. And man, she'll give you the ride of your life. 
This is bit. Wow. Ah. Come on, I'll tongue your asshole. <laughs> and then I'll blow into your ear, and then I'll touch your earlobe with my tongue you while I didn't. finger you and stick my wrist up your ass. <laughs> and then you squirt yeah. because I have battery cables on your nipples. <laughs> oh! Uh, and I'm I gonna, love that yeah. everything he does, the woman moans. Yeah, I'll moan. They're probably She's moaning, gonna stop. moan. Get right in her rear and whisper <laughs> your age. That'll turn around. And put thumbtacks in her nipples. I'm 105. Uh, oh. No. <laughs> I've learned a few things. Uh, oh, wait. I just got a note here. The squirters clip at the bottom is the grossest. There's one more Ronnie clip before oh, I move on. No. They say this is the most disgusting one of all. Okay. And now, a sexy tip from Ronnie the limo driver. If you ever come across a girl who's a squirter, first of all, put a towel down on the bed. What's going to happen is you're going to be down there eating her out, and all of a sudden she's going to start to scream. And when she screams, she's going to shoot. She's going to shoot like she's taking a piss, dude. But it's not piss. It really is cum. But it's very, very liquidy, but it is clear. So it's not piss. Just remember that. And what you're going to wind up doing, man, is you're going to wind up taking a nice drink. This has been oh. a sex. Oh. <laughs> wow. <laughs> oh my god. And and they're screaming and moaning yeah. and, and pissing and, and squirming. <laughs> it's the, and lashing <laughs> and thrusting. <laughs> Any way I can unhear that like <laughs> take back what I just heard. <laughs> Can you remove that from my brain? Can they do an operation like they did on the Kennedy daughter? You know what's going to happen? What? Superman has to come now and, and turn the earth backwards. The earth. <laughs> so, yeah. Uh, Jason was just telling me Dr. Harry Fish discussed the subject on his. Uh, oh. Show. It's definitely urine. It's urine, right? Yeah, Dr. Ronnie doesn't. Hey, think you're it's taking urine. a drink. Don't tell me that. It's definitely not piss. It's, it's come clear. On, I'm telling you it's that. It's come. And you're going to take a nice drink. After you <laughs> Dracula bite her, get down there and eat her out and drink clear. Come. Oh, I'm going to throw up. It's fluid. <laughs> boy, oh boy, what a sexual guy. If uh, you ever come across a squirter. Better put down a towel. But how do you know she's a squirter first? I mean, how do you know? She has one of those medical bands. <laughs> oh, oh, thank you, Ronnie. Oh. She has a squirter I alert got a band. Squirter alert. Oh, you've got diabetes. Okay, eat this. Now we can fuck. <laughs> yes, Rob. Hey, Howard. How are hey. You? What's up? What? Yeah, he's the biggest piece of shit, isn't he? Who? Ronnie. What? Why are you saying that? No, I mean, look at the way he weasels his way into every single thing, every single day. <laughs> it's constant. Every single day, he weasels his way into some kind of subject. It's unbelievable. He didn't do anything wrong. I mean, he just... We decided to talk about him. <laughs> they should make him eat Richard's asshole out. That's what you make him. <laughs> <laughs> well, okay, judging but... from these tips, he might. Yeah. <laughs> you lash him down. If, uh... <laughs> and you stick your finger right in his ace. If you're with a boom. girl or a guy, you <laughs> lash him down. And then when you put your tongue up Richard's ass... Oh, he'll it's squirt it's out of his penis. But don't worry, it's not pee. That's cum, That's not cum, pee. Cum. And beer. <laughs> <laughs> yes, Elise. Yes, Elise. Hello. Howard knows what he's talking about. Who? Howard. Yes. Ronnie knows exactly what he's talking about. You just said Howard knows what he's talking about. Well, I'm sure you do too, but you don't want to admit it. But Ronnie knows what he's talking about. And what, where, where when, what, what did he say? All of those tapes that you're playing, yeah. I'm telling you, he is right on the money. Is Women that right? love that. Love what, eating ass? Everything. Rubbing their head when you bl when they blow everything. I'm telling you, he 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 knows exactly what turns a woman on. Gee, I got to tell you. Wow. Uh, I've been with my wife a long time. I don't think she goes for any of that shit. Well, <laughs> she doesn't Ronnie, want me eating her ass. Listen to Ronnie. Yeah. Come back and report because I'm telling you, I met him in person. He smelled delicious. Did you make love to Ronnie? Would I or did I? Did you? No, I did not. 
Oh, then you really can't say that this is all yes, good. Yes, I can because I was with someone once that did everything that Ronnie <laughs> talks about. Is that right? Do you uh, know the... Are you a squirter? <laughs> Is that P or cum? <laughs> it's not I'm P. Just, I'm just calling in Ronnie's defense. I'm a 32-year-old fan. I love you, Howard. Well, Dr. Harry Ronnie Fish doesn't about. know anything. I'm no, telling you doesn't. that was no P. <laughs> no, he doesn't. He doesn't know what he's talking about. Get ready Dr. for a drink. <laughs> Love you, Howard. Have a great day. Thank you. Get ready for a drink, Robin. Take a nice drink. Take a nice, nice drink. Dr a nice drink. <laughs> a nice drink. Mm. I have windshield wipers put on my glasses <laughs> so I can eat right through that flood. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. I'm not sure what my beard smells like, but it don't smell like pee. <laughs> <laughs> we need to give him that camera. Yeah. Camera clap. <laughs> yeah, never mind me. Make sure it's waterproof. <laughs> Put a towel over it. Go! 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 <laughs> hey, they say, Roddy, why can't you see my GoPro? Well, there's a towel over it for squatting. It looks like you're driving to a tsunami. <laughs> A pussy tsunami! <laughs> I pronounced the T! That's right! Uh, <laughs> tsunami! Uh, <laughs> I learned that from George the King. That's right! Because uh, I grab his head when he's down blowing me! And he likes it! And now, a sexy tip from Ronnie the limo driver. If you ever come across a girl who's a squirter, first of all, put a towel down on the bed. What's going to happen is you're going to be down there eating her out, and all of a sudden she's going to start to scream. And when she screams, she's going to shoot. She's going to shoot like she's taking a piss, dude. But it's dude. not piss. It really is cum. But it's very, very liquidy, but it is clear. So it's not piss. Just remember that. And what you're going to wind up doing, man, is you're going to wind up taking a nice drink. This has been us. You've been drinking that shit? That's He's the urine. old man of the sea right Dr. here. Dr. It's not urine, Dr. dude. Dr. Harry Fish said fuck it is. Fuck him. He doesn't know what the <laughs> fuck he's talking about. He's a medical doctor. <laughs> yeah, Stupid you ass. You just don't want to know you're a urine drinker. <laughs> it's not urine. Okay? When, uh, <laughs> case closed. <laughs> Let's see. Chad, you're on the air. Hey, hello, guys. Uh... <laughs> Oh, hey, Fred, you all right? Wait, I'm trying to hear the caller. What, Chad? <laughs> I said, uh, I love these uh, sex tips. They're hilarious. And it's great to bust Ronnie's balls. But meanwhile, they're all 100% accurate. He's right on the money. I fuck tons of girls. And if, if you do what he's talking about, hmm. you know? Yeah, so Dracula these, bites, uh, eat some ass. Yeah, put a towel down. Towel, guys, tie him up. Yeah, head massage when I'm blowing a guy. What's with yeah, you? That one's a little weird. No, it's not. Like, you're talking about it from the guy blowing another guy's perspective. Wait, right? he's just you trying have, to be what? inclusive. I mean, a man Ronnie's age is, you know, he's trying to get with the times. He's trying to uh, be progressive and equality and all that. Yeah, with the times, dude. I've been doing this for years. What are you talking about? <laughs> and Where you I mean, I mean uh, speaking to it as if from the both the male and female perspective. Yeah, but what, where, is this, where is this male thing coming I'll, from? I'll play it for you. But by yeah. the way, you say women do not like being fingered, right? So you should tie them. Some women don't. Right. Some do. Some don't. You yeah. got to learn. You got to learn, man. You got to know their spots. So what, why not just not finger them? I no, mean, but no, I don't. I, 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 like that's not what I said. Me. Tell me what the, your theory is there. That's not I what I said. You if saying, you listen to my sex tip, yeah. listen carefully, you right. know what I'm talking about. <laughs> what are you saying? You spread her open wide, man. Yeah, but what if she doesn't like being fingered? You don't finger her, though. You, you just, you're just very lightly touching her clit. Very lightly. <laughs> it's like almost taking a feather yeah. and, and put, you know, playing with it. Yeah. It fucking How did you learn so much? It drive, I don't know. I just fucking... I don't who know. I'm fucking crazy. Wild. Yeah, who are you driving wild? <laughs> uh, yeah, Stephan Stephanie, for one. Well, you're saying like you're an idiot savant. In other words, you didn't have to have a lot of women. You just are a savant. You know what you need to do. It just comes naturally. Yeah, but I have my share. Yeah. I've had my share, believe right. me. Take it easy. Hey, Kevin, hey, can I, take it easy. Howard, can I share a tip for Ronnie? Yeah. Go ahead, man. You know, some girls like it... Not every girl likes a lot of heavy finger penetration. He's dead on right there. But not all girls like heavy clit friction. Another one, if you want to do the same thing, but not on the clit, go down there to, you know, for lack of a better term, right there, the pussy hole, and just go round and round 
The uh, yeah, yeah. Right yeah, 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 exactly. Yeah, yeah, I know. I know That's that. called the three-inch <laughs> maneuver. Yeah, I know that deal. But listen, dude, when you when you do the clit thing, it's not uh -huh. heavy friction. I'm gonna throw up from you. Too. It's not heavy friction. <laughs> it's just, These it's, have a it's like you're bar you barely touching her clit, man. It it drives him fucking wild. Yeah, I know. I'm on your team, Ronnie. I called in to defend you. Also. No, I'm not right. saying. I don't need defending. Uh, believe me. They, oh yeah. They talk, uh, they talk shit about you. They're all actually jealous. That's right. Nah, they're not jealous. Guys, guys like <laughs> no one's jealous. No one's jealous. <laughs> Nobody's <laughs> jealous of me. Thank you. All right, Chad. <laughs> Ronnie, do you have more tips? Will we? Oh, there's plenty more coming. Oh, Record right. some new. Ones. I did. This, they got a shitload of my just. Do they? Did. Yeah. Oh, good. Okay. Like, what else you got? About? Well, I mean, I'm not I think telling you. you. Really? You don't have? Well, I'm not going to tell you. I'll tell you when I record them. All right. That's my Sal and Richard deal. I got other right. I'm ideas. not allowed to tell you until I, until he comes on the air. It's more fun that way. And you swear that when you make a girl squirt. Yeah. It's not pee. It's not pee. Even though a I medical don't give a doctor shit is fish, telling you I don't that care what fish is. Mm -hmm. Fucking you, guy does a show on Howard 101. What kind of doctor is he? <laughs> <laughs> well said. He's probably never had a squirter, right? Right. right. Exactly. Yeah, yeah, yeah. He never put a towel down. <laughs> That's a question, too. How do you know a girl... You've, if a girl's a squirter or not, so you, no. know. Oh, yeah. you find you find out, man. And then, so you ruin the bed the first time, right? Yeah, oh yeah, <laughs> you got that right. Hello, sleepies. <laughs> you got that Hello, right. sleepies. Send another mattress to Ronnie the limo you're driver. Out, you, you, you're, yeah. da you're down there ripping the sheet off, and then you're fucking scrubbing the, the mattress, right? And drying it up with a hair blower. Oh. <laughs> The urine stained mattress, which is not urine, is on the curb. Yeah, but it does see? That's the difference. It doesn't stain. That's right, it's magical. If it was piss, if it was piss, it would be a big yellow Club stain. Is magic. It disappears. It's like that disappearing ink. Or that thing where you see Jesus' face in a frosty window. <laughs> it's organic. <laughs> I'm telling you, Dr. Harry Fish knows a thing or two. I don't think so. Don't be drinking that Sorry. shit. You're going to get a I nice don't, what drink. What do you think? I take it a gla in a glass? Well, you go, you're going to get a nice drink. Yeah, well, well, what does it taste like, Ronnie? Not piss. <laughs> <laughs> well, I don't know. I don't know what piss tastes like, but. Uh, now we're going to have to do a taste test. Well, I think you do, actually. No, I don't. Because you drink it. That's that not shit. piss. It's not ask, piss. Ask any fucking <laughs> sex therapist or anything. They know it's hey. not piss. Well, not they don't <laughs> want people screaming. <laughs> it's not piss. Tie them up. You're going to scream. <laughs> <laughs> All right, guys. Well, I got to take a break, and we'll be back right after these words. Do you ever envision yourself being such a sexual pioneer? I mean, I'm a Scorpio. But you always knew you had it in you. I'm a Scorpio. So that means you're sexually charged. You got that fucking right, dude. But it seems like only in the last 10 to 15 years you've really unleashed My that first on girlfriend used to be s soaking wet when I'd fuck with her. Mm -hmm. At 13 years old, both mm -hmm. of us were like a week apart in age. We're both Scorpios. I'd love to find her just to see how. I'd love to find my first girlfriend. I think I could learn a little something from you. I think so. Just keep listening to the radio, man. Keep listening. You'll learn. You'll come, will, you'll come to me one morning and you go, Hey, dude, I just off the record. I don't want anybody to know about this. But, man, some of your shit's really fucking good. I had my girlfriend going fucking crazy last night. You tell me. You're going to tell me that. You'll see. I hope you're right. You'll see. You'll see. Maybe I'll write a book. Who knows? The Mun Diaries. The Mun Chronicles. Yeah. A life of sex. Security. Sex in the shitty. City. Shitty Ooh. city. Oh. <laughs> uh, let's go to Vito. Vito, you're on the air. Morning, Howard. How are Morning. you doing right now? Uh, hey, you know. by, any chance, by any chance, did you... I'm sorry to ask you this, bro. Uh, Ronnie Sexton, did you by any chance try any of them on staff? What? <laughs> we get, we can't get, get any luck. We can't get one guy with a decent phone connection. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Let me get you on my headset. Hold on. His headset. Now we have to wait for. Oh him. my god. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. <laughs> Where is he now? <laughs> wait, 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 wait. I, I, I talk sorry, to people yeah, every I'm day. Sorry. Nobody has a phone like it this. Guess what? I have a good phone. It's an iPhone 4S. Yeah. Well, I'm guess what? It ain't working. Trying my Bluetooth piece of shit. I apologize. Yeah, yeah. He's hooked um, in with that Bluetooth. Okay, he's got a. My question for First you of is, all, I worry about that Bluetooth being so close to my brain. I I, I don't like it. I, do I don't, you have a Bluetooth? Fuck no, I don't. All right. I tried it one time. I said, what's this box that's sitting next to my jawline? Well, I'll 
I'm forced to have it because if I if I don't put it on, I get a two thousand dollar fine from the. I got news for you. It's not. It's it, it, your phone connection is horrible. Stop making phone calls. <laughs> Period. <laughs> Yell out the window. Question real quick. By any chance, did you try any of that uh, Ronnie sex tips on Beth? Uh, did I try any Ronnie sex tips on Beth? I got to tell you something. Once you hear those Ronnie sex tips, your sex life is over. <laughs> I've never heard anything more disgusting in my life. I mean, this, first of all, this guy's in his 60s. He's so sexed up. And how he became such an expert is beyond me. Yeah, he acts like he's been with 3,000 women or something. <laughs> but I can't, yeah, it's exactly. Like Julio Iglesias. Uh, Ronnie, yeah, Holmes. Yeah. Ronnie Holmes. Ronnie Holmes. <laughs> Ronnie Holmes. I got to tell you something, Vito. Everywhere I went yesterday, I mean, what, whenever there's, I, I ran into a woman who listens to our show. They were like, Ronnie, ew. You know, like, like. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, all right. They were going crazy. And uh, people can't believe it. The way he's carrying on with the sex. People can't believe what an expert you are, Ronnie. Uh, you don't have to be with 3,000 women, Rob. How many women have you been with? I don't know. I, know. I don't count. You claim to know. I don't count. I'm not, I'm not one of those guys who sits and counts. give me a ballpark figure. I would say 50. This really? Show? Yeah. I think you've been with more. Maybe. Well, I don't know. I don't do count. You've been with more. I don't count. What? I know Why do you think he's been with more? Cuz I know everyone. I know everything Ronnie's up to. And vice versa. In the short span of his divorce before no, he met? No, no. Before I was married when I was younger and all that belonging. <laughs> oh, you mean when you were 5 and you were No, when I was a teenager, <laughs> damn wit. <laughs> <laughs> How about Ronnie calling you a My first mother? girlfriend. I had my first girlfriend at 14. And, and so we, there were 50 women before you got married? No, he had a, a period of time. Uh, well, uh, he, yes, before he got married. Yeah. He had 50 women. Ah, oh, please. <laughs> give me what a do break. You mean, what do you mean, give me a break? <laughs> He's very sexy. And, and you knew, and you were gaining this knowledge all that time. One thing he's an expert yeah. on is sex <laughs> and driving. And you remember it, you know. You can't remember your high school what? teachers. But no, you who the hell wants to remember them? Sex. I don't want to remember this. my high school teachers. <laughs> you were too busy having sex. I want to, I want to remember <laughs> the girls that I cut school with. Uh... Yeah, well, I believe that part of the story. Oh, yeah. yeah, I know you cut school. Yeah, I cut school obvious. a lot. Yeah, we can I tell. cut school a lot. <laughs> that, that grammar is worse than anyone's. Yeah, okay. But I still graduated, so... Hey, you, got, you got by. You got by. They just wanted by. to get rid of you. Yeah, yeah good. <laughs> no, Ronnie was a, a big pussy hound during the Great Depression. Yeah, yeah. He's, exactly. <laughs> he took advantage of a lot of women. And no, that's but, where you learned. These women taught you, or you figured this out on your own? You're a genius. A little of both. A lot was made of Ronnie... Uh, he was talking one of his sex tips about squirting, which I I even hear that word I want to throw. Well, that, well, that, that's the one that squirt. seems to bother everybody the most for some reason. Doctor Fish says Ronnie is in fact drinking urine. Okay, and he, I, I'm telling he I'm telling you he's wrong, but okay. And Ronnie's saying that that is not urine; it is some sort of other substance. It's yeah, the guy nectar. who stayed in school. Ronnie's arguing. With. It's called pre cum. It's pre cum. Pre cum. I discovered it in 1957. Sputnik. <laughs> Had just been launched. <laughs> Where's um, this pre cum coming from, Ronnie? From the pussy. <laughs> from the pre cum gland. I don't know. I don't examine where it comes from. He has no medical knowledge whatsoever. The Dr. Fish who studied a woman's body. Yeah, okay, yeah, he studied. And the vagina. Yeah, he's doing a show on one on one. Yeah, he studied. Yeah, he's a doctor. Body. He's a yeah. medical he has doctor. A, a degree I, and I think, a, I think he's a, actually a urologist. Dr. He Cronkite. Is. He is a urologist. Dr. He studied Cronkite. penis and vagina. Uh, okay. The pussy is a complicated thing. Oh, no. and Dr. Fish doesn't know anything. He's on 101. That's right. He I never put a towel down. He never took a drink. Oh, oh, oh. And now, a sexy tip from Ronnie the limo driver. If you ever come across a girl who's a squirter, first of all, put a towel down on the bed. What's going to happen is... Oh, thanks, Ron. I didn't know that. You're going to be down there eating her out. And 
I don't know, man. I'm ready to vomit. We'll right be now. down there eating well. <laughs> Get used to the idea. Hey, excuse me, this is a more relaxed ride. Yeah, wouldn't you maybe not eat her out if she's a squirter? Uh, no, you have to eat her out. Uh, <laughs> yeah, it's the only way they squirt. <laughs> All of a sudden, she's going to start to scream, and when she screams, she's going to shoot. Yeah, she's calling the police. You fuck. <laughs> she's going to shoot like she's taking a piss, dude. But dude. <laughs> it's not piss. It really is cum, but oh. it's very, very liquidy. But it is clear, so oh. it's not piss. Just remember that. And what you're going to wind up doing. Man, you're gonna wind up taking a nice drink. Oh, this has been a oh, sexy tip from Ronnie the Limo. Driver. Nothing sexier than that. That was quite a nice drink. You got any beer nuts to go with it? <laughs> <laughs> Thank you for the drink. You know I'm a ref, and no one wants to give me a drink. Thank no. you. You're gonna wind up taking a nice drink. Yep, and that ain't pee. But it ain't piss. <laughs> it's cum. Cum, and it's clear. <laughs> hey, and bring a towel. That's just a sexy tip. Put the towel down. <laughs> Put a towel down. That's right. I'm just saying, unless you're a millionaire and you don't yeah. need your bed. You're going to be tossing it out, I'm telling you. I don't know why, because it's not pee. It's a clear liquid that you I drink. I wonder how he figures out that they're squirters. Well... You mean, how do I put a top? I just figure every girl I'm with is going to squirt. <laughs> they got to walk. They got a certain kind of walk. They got a stench. If you come across a girl who's a squirter. Better put a towel down. That's right. Or put some gutters on her leg. <laughs> it's so romantic when gutters on her leg. It's so romantic when you lay that towel down and tell her, right. hop on this. Here, dear. Hold Here, dear. on a second. Preparation. Spread them open. What? It's pre-cum. I wish Ronnie would explain that again. Yeah, I mean, like, where is pre-cum in a woman? Under the pussy flaps. <laughs> <laughs> Dr. Drew actually wrote me a big letter essentially saying that Ronnie was right, that he believes that... See? He, well, yeah. Where's pre-cum? I mean, you can't call it pre-cum. It's pre-cum. <laughs> it's in a holding pen. <laughs> it's like pre-promotion. <laughs> <laughs> it is designated... It's free. You know cum. who's a squirter? Dr. Drew. <laughs> Dr. Drew says Ronnie's right. They got an argument with the doctors. What is a uh, pre cum? Uh, explain just real rapidly for everyone why it's not pee. I have a video out there. Tabitha so Stevens I was interviewed have a... by Shuli, and Shuli said it's piss. Oh, please. Because Tabitha is... Stevens told him. And she, she doesn't got a know. She doesn't know. What does oh. she know? Yeah. I, got, I saw it for myself. This girl. And somebody else that was with me, another a girl yeah. who has the video out there. Rachel has it. Yeah, we saw. She went in the bathroom with this girl, and she had uh, Benoit balls in her pussy. <laughs> All right, okay, yeah, I'm gonna throw. Oh, Lord. I'm gonna Where's throw. The music? And she pulled. <laughs> she had Benoit balls. She's got <laughs> balls in the Wait a minute. <laughs> and she she pulled out the balls. Yeah. And she blew her load, man. She squirted all over the place. All right. But well, where is it? And then she peed on. right after that. Oh. So, oh. Oh. Right. so uh -huh. there's proof. It's where was proof. this other liquid coming from? From her pussy. I don't know. Ask Rachel. She's got the video. From she the, was, no, Rachel was it. Rachel, get in here. From the upper pussy. <laughs> Rachel. It's from the pre-pussy. Get in here. Get, grab Rachel, that Rachel, what do you know Put that thing this. on your head. You're Tell him about him? the pre -cum. Put that on your head. You know about it. Yes. So I actually taped this no, video. No, just walk into that. All right, so yeah. I taped this video. I actually <laughs> accidentally shot a porn because the guy sent me in to see if she was peeing or she was squirting, what was coming out of Ugh. it. So she pulls out these Benoit balls, and there's a weird, like, glandular fluid just shoots out of her crotch. And it's the, she's, like, having an orgasm, writhing, and I'm in the bathroom stall taping this. Yeah. Then she sits down <laughs> and fully pees afterwards. Wow. So and Maybe then, Ronnie knows something. She, she did this three or four times. She squirted, so there was a lot of... <laughs> I told you, from a pussy. <laughs> she did it. She did it on the... She did it on the floor she, in the... In the, in the hallway of the hotel. idea what these two are talking <laughs> oh about. Oh, my God. Yeah, you know what we're talking uh, about. Here's the letter from Dr. Drew. Let's get a little more technical. Yeah, okay. Then, uh, ben yeah, yeah, balls yeah, and yeah Robin's best friend. Yeah. Uh, Gary, <laughs> been hearing you guys arguing about Ronnie's claim that female ejaculate is not urine. In fact, he may be right. Right, while a certain percentage of the time the emission is urine, in which case it is called female orgasmic incontinence. It is often more an ejaculate, very similar to what men produce. Women actually have a gland called the periurethral gland. Uh -huh. When you look at it under the microscope, the tissue is identical to a man's prostate. Some women have a more developed gland and can produce a fair amount of fluid that is emitted during orgasm. There are obviously also a number of other glands in the vicinity, skeins, bartholin, blah, 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 oh which my. can also produce a fair bit of fluid. There you go. Hope this is useful, Drew Pinsky. And <laughs> oh, it's very useful. Take that, Dr. Fish. <laughs> All right.
But most of the time it's pee, Ronnie. No. You probably no. drank some pee. It's, no, I didn't drink it's pee. The <laughs> juice of the pussy, like a coconut. Too. It's the pre pussy. When pre-cum. it shoots when it shoots out like that robin. <laughs> it's cum. So sit back You've and never had anybody pee. Sit, no. Sit back and have a nice drink, Robin. You're gonna wind up with a taking a nice drink. Hey, did I hear that right on the wrap up show? You're gonna make out with a guy? Yeah. Huh? Who's the guy? Mike. High pitch Mike? Yeah. You're gonna make out with yeah. him? What's that all about? No, I, I don't wanna say. Are you bi? You know, I don't wanna say what it's about. But you're I, bi. No, I'm not. You know why I know he's bi? No, I'm now? not bi. One of his you? sex tips is talking about grabbing a yeah, guy's head while no. he's bi. God his head. damn it, dude. You, they cut you're that bi. up the wrong. No, they cut that. No, they didn't. Oh, yes, they did. Not according to the guys. No, they cut. Here's what I said. I said. That that sex tip was good for guys and, and you, girls. And you, know how you always say, "I meet girls, I meet guys." Yeah, so I'm about meeting girls. I'm about meeting. Who's about guys. meeting guys? I meet guys at a strip club. There's plenty of guys at a strip club. And you're about meeting guys. What's wrong with meeting guys? I just think you're bi. I'm not putting I'm you not down for bi. it. I'm not bi. Hey, man, I'm all for it. Dude, I, I am not. I'm scores, man. Dude, dude I'll kill you. And I'm, I'm about I'm getting drunk. I'm, I'm about having fun. Yeah, I'm about having a good time. About? I'm about you're gonna meeting make out girls. I'm yeah, I'll make out with my bitch Mike for a reason. A reason. I don't care what the fucking reason is. <laughs> I don't care if it's for your mother to save your mother's life. My mother's dead already. I'm well, sorry. I know that. I'm using it figuratively. I know what you're saying. No, you don't. Yes, I do. What is he saying? He's saying it's pee. Show that your favorite. Were you just threatened by your head of security? Yeah, he's gonna I know. kill me. What are you killing me for? You're the guy. You're making. I'm out kidding. All right. Jesus. Oh, God, I hope so. Uh, it's been a long day. Yeah, it has yeah. Been. All right, go back and make out with high pitch Mike. I will. All right. And he's make out with Rachel. Squirt. What? No, make out that I would with enjoy. <laughs> make out with a girl. What What's wrong with him? You've been thinking. Hey, hey, what did Stephanie think of you making out with Lisa G? I never even got a chance to ask what? you. Everything cool with you making out with Lisa G? Stephanie didn't care, right? No, she was fine with it. The only thing was. Just like I didn't know it was going to happen yesterday. Right. Yeah. So it when was she, a surprise to her. So when she woke up, because she, you know, she works late, so she gets up later. But she want to be prepared for it. Yeah. <laughs> so she woke up and she happened to get on Twitter yesterday morning, and she saw the thing from Howard TV. <laughs> kind of, uh, kind of shocked her a little bit. You know. But she was cool, right? No, she was yeah. fine with it. You she think about it at all, or like what? you just forgot about? Think about Lisa. Yeah. Um. Seriously. Yeah, it was cool. Did you think about her at all when you got home? Like, did you think about, like, palming her ass or anything, or no? I thought it was funny. Oh. That she let, let me do it. So it wasn't like a thing where you, like, went home and went, hmm, you know, hey, that was pretty cool. It was cool. Yeah, okay. I told her this morning I thought it was cool. Right. Mm. Again. I think she wants to do it again. Man. I heard you made Stephanie cry this weekend. What? That's what I heard. That was a rumor. What? Because you warned some guy not to get married, and then she got upset because she wants to marry you. I warned some guy. That's right. What are that you talking true? about? I, I got that information wrong. It was gossip. Who told you that? I'm not going to say. Oh, it's Shirley. <laughs> what are you talking about? What guy? Well, he, he, uh, there was a guy who was engaged to be married, and Ronnie uh, made an announcement. He's like, don't fucking do it, bro. I, I'm never making that mistake again. And then apparently he got backstage and uh, Steph wasn't too happy with that. Oh, and did she wait cry? a minute. Hold on, hold on, hold on. She was squirting through her eyes. Where, where, what guy? <laughs> who was the guy? You didn't make her squirt? <laughs> who, who was the guy? The guy in the crowd that, that was getting married. When you were performing. Yeah. The guy. Oh, yeah. No, she wasn't crying. What are you That's what you do? told me. You said she was crying backstage. No, she wasn't crying. What are you talking about? <laughs> She'd be crying every day. <laughs> oh, remind me. i got to ask you about a camera later, okay? Mm. Sure. All right. I got to remind you to ask me yeah, about it. I, 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 I don't got enough to fucking worry about. Yeah, well. Why don't you write it down and then ask me? Yeah, because I was supposed to ask you three days ago. <laughs> I have to now remind him. Yes, please remind me. You work for me. <laughs> Just remind we'll drink me. some piss. All right. No, it's okay. not piss. It is. It's, it's, it's not. Do you hear what Dr. Drew said? And he's smarter than any doctor because he knows about Robin how, you know, her deal. <laughs> right, whatever that is. It's like talking to a caveman. It, it, Tabitha Stevens said yeah. she's done it a few times, and when she's done it, she it peed. was piss. Yeah, of course. Well, of course. that's Tabitha Stevens. 
But you you have to admit you're drinking piss at some point. At right. some no. Point. Well, then some girl then girls are drinking piss also when when you blow a load in their mouth. <laughs> no. <laughs> no. No. <laughs> Dude. Uh, what did Dr. Drew just say? It's the same thing as a guy's prostate. He said when it he can blo- be when you blow your too. load. He, he, but he said it's it the same as kind also. of a, like a guy. All right. So, Listen to Dr. Jew. It's piss. Mm. <laughs> Done deal. No, it's Come on, not piss drinker. It's Let's not. Go. Let All me right. go. Right. And both of you get out of here. Remind me about the camera later. Okay. Oh, also, tell me, me i got to pick up some groceries, too. <laughs> yeah. Tell me what else you need me to remind you about. And pay my car payment. Oh, my God. There's a loony hatch. 